Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna quickly walk you through the steps on how to change the map that you want your RoboRock Robo Vacuum to use when it's cleaning. So what we're gonna do is launch the RoboRock application. Then we're gonna select the robot vacuum that we'd like to change the map for. So it'll show the map that it last did right here on this page. If you'd like to change it to a map that you have already mapped out with your robot vacuum, you can click on this little map edit option right here. And then you can select the map in this area. So I'm going to change over to the other map option. And then it will change to that map that I had just selected. And you can change these different map options up in your settings, clicking on these three horizontal dots up here. And you can go down to where it says manage maps and click on that. And of course, to get multiple maps, what you need to make sure is that you have multi-level selected for your home layout. And in terms of which map your robot vacuum is going to use when it starts cleaning, you can either have it selected on smart recognition where the robot automatically recognizes its location and switches between the maps when it starts. Or you can do a manual selection where you can choose the map manually in the app when starting the robot. And the robot will clean based on your selected map. I recommend doing smart recognition when the robot cleans. It should recognize its surroundings and pick the correct map based on that information. But if you'd like to manually select which map that it is going to clean with on the map page for your robot vacuum you can just simply select here in the edit map details by selecting the map that you would like it to use if you'd like to do that manually so i hope this video is helpful going over how you can select which map you want your robovac to use while it's cleaning and how you can have this set up either automatically or manually in the settings i appreciate you guys stopping by consider subscribing to the youtube channel and i'll see you back here next time